Ici Hugo Ternès en direct de l'école secondaire Marie-Rivier, une école de langue française située ici à Kingston. Radio-Canada a appris que l'école a reçu un appel à la bombe ce matin vers 8h45 alors que les cours venaient de commencer. Nous estimons qu'environ 500 élèves fréquentent l'établissement. La police de Kingston est sur place, elle a ordonné une évacuation sur le champ et celle-ci est en cours. La directrice, Judith Saint-Seine, a décliné notre demande d'entrevue. Nous avons fait une demande d'entrevue avec le Conseil catholique et nous attendons toujours leur réponse. C'était Hugo Ternès pour Radio-Canada en direct de Kingston. This is Eloise Rodriguez standing outside St. François Elementary School here in Ottawa, where shocked and terrified students and staff are reacting to yet another bomb threat on a Catholic school. Ottawa police and bomb threat experts are on scene. Hundreds of children have now been evacuated. This is the third reported bomb threat directed at an Ontario Catholic school this morning. It began with Marie Rivier High School in Kingston, and then shortly afterwards, a bomb threat was received at Académie Catholique Ange Gabriel in Brockville. Both Marie Rivier High School and Saint François Elementary School are part of the Conseil des Écoles Catholiques de Centre Est, the French Catholic School Board. Moments before coming on air, CBC Ottawa learned that a fourth school, St. Mark's Secondary School in Manatic, just south of Ottawa, has also received a bomb threat. Police are on scene there now. Although St. Mark's is an English language high school, which is part of the Ottawa Catholic District School Board, some parents and educators are speculating that this may be part of a coordinated attack on Catholic teaching. Social media has lit up with speculation on the reasons for this wave of bomb threats. There have been no official comments from the school boards in question, but pressure is mounting to hear something quickly as anxious parents are looking for information and reassurance. This is Eloise Rodriguez, CBC Ottawa, reporting live from St. Francois Elementary School in Ottawa. We're here live outside Ottawa Police Headquarters where a news conference ended just moments ago. The joint efforts by our CMP, OPP and police forces from Ottawa, Kingston and Brockville have resulted in the arrest of a suspect police believe is behind all four of today's bomb threats targeting Catholic high schools in eastern Ontario. Even though police are withholding the suspect's name at this point as he is a minor, they revealed that he was expelled from a Catholic high school and was deeply angered about what he felt was an injustice in the way he was treated. Police described his behavior as unstable and agitated when they came to arrest him. The young man was taken to Kingston City Jail a few minutes ago, where he's being held for questioning. It's expected that formal charges will be laid this afternoon. Police said the emergency is now over, and it will be up to both French and English Catholic school boards to determine the next steps. We understand that they may be holding a news conference shortly. Sébastien Duval, CTV Ottawa, live from the Ottawa Police Headquarters.